on YouTube. I want to address shorty girl that work at the post office. Shorty girl that work inside the post office. That's rewriting my mail for <clears throat> the crooks that's involved in my case. You know those. Are, that's a federal charge. Not only is you not scanning my certified mail, but you didn't change the address and sending it to people that's paying you to send it to them. Okay. Shorty and Earl just got the podcast with my image and my voice on it. First of all, I haven't signed anything giving y'all permission to use my image or my voice. Y'all hacked into my AT&T account, cloned my phone, took over my YouTube channel, locked my YouTube channel, shadow banned my YouTube channel, and I made a podcast up like I'm in business with y'all. I have not signed anything, no type of contracts with y'all, giving y'all permission to use my followers. I have not signed anything, giving y'all permission to collect money for me, to do endorsements for me. None of that. So that whole podcast with my image and voice on it is fraudulent. And y'all will be paying me for using my image. And for the civil service or secret service or whatever the fuck you is, dude that's messing with a chick that's involved with my case, and you got me in an illegal investigation. <laughs> yeah, I know about that. Coming in and out of my house when I'm not here, I know about that too. Trying to set me up with drugs, saying that I'm <laughs> I'm selling drugs for a cartel. I'm a hard-working woman, and I have always bust my ass to make my money, even with my podcast. That's strictly me. Well, change that, because that podcast is not mine. With my YouTube channel, it's strictly me. I'm solo dolo, okay? I don't have anybody working with me. Everything I do is strictly me, Okay? And for the clowns that's following me around, gang stalking me and shit, <laughs> that's a charge too. You know that, right? You're going to be a part of this Rico case too. <laughs> Trust and believe that. Every last one of y'all motherfuckers going to be in this Rico case. Okay? So keep it up because you ain't doing nothing but stacking the evidence. Watch my moves. That's all I can say. Why y'all trying to get my routine down pat? And shorty girl, shorty boy, whoever, that's thinking about coming to tell me shit about what's going on with my case, already know. And the only reason you coming to tell me anything is because they try to clear your name, even though you involved in it also, and you just mad. <laughs> because shit ain't work out the way you wanted it to. That's not my problem, because all of y'all should have, especially the chicks in here that's got little kids. Y'all should have thought about that shit. Thought about y'all kids before y'all did this dumb shit. Because a lot of y'all about to go to jail. And who the fuck gonna take care of your kids? Especially shorty girl at the post office. If you got little kids or grandkids, you about to go to federal jail. <laughs> a lot of y'all about to go to federal jail. Because this is a federal case. If you don't realize that. I'm letting you know. And for. What is it? The steel company out of Virginia Beach. That make lawnmowers and weed eaters. And all of that. That's being run by a bunch of racists. Y'all got mad at my daughter. Because. She, her coming in there. As the only token black girl came in there showing y'all how to get y'all company right yeah especially shorty boy that's been there for 20 something years and you got a lot to do with this too because you didn't like the way she came in there and was handling shit 
So you tried to sabotage her a whole lot of times. Changing paperwork, all type of shit on her. Y'all racist people. Y'all gonna be in my case too. Okay? So still, get prepared. Still in Virginia Beach. Yeah. Because y'all is a bunch of racists. And the lady that actually had her like my daughter's her skills and the way she was handling that job so good less than two months she had a company phone and the man that's been there for over 20 years didn't like that with his white racist tail so he started plotting him and them other old white men that's been working there for a long time y'all plotted together on y'all cigarette breaks to sabotage my daughter yeah and y'all also was paid by the crooks involved in my case for the fire her. And y'all gonna hear about this shit too. And y'all gonna pay her. Because y'all just racially discriminated against her. Yeah. Trust and believe that. All y'all racist companies that's mad because these black folks coming in there shining. Yeah. And y'all feel threatened, intimidated, because she's smart as a motherfucker with a pearl legal motherfucking degree. Yeah. Motherfuckers in Newport News even plotted against blocking her from getting her pearl legal job because y'all know she gifted. But y'all ain't gonna be able to stop her because she gonna get what Divine got for her, the Holy Spirit got for us, is ours. And we gonna get it. So, Step in our way if you want to. You will be moved. Okay? And for... Oh, yeah. You know the seven shockers? The motherfuckers that's been attacking my seven shockers? You know about the seven deadly sins? Yeah. Expect... The seven spirits to go along with the seven deadly sins to come and attack your ass for that, okay? For messing with a chosen person. Alright? Yeah. And like I've been telling y'all since last year, a lot of y'all about to die. And it's gonna be some high-ranking masons, high-ranking entertainers, actors, <laughs> politicians just about to lose their life for the dumb shit that y'all involved in you see you never know you should always be nice to people because you never know when you're entertaining an earth angel okay yeah so expect to reap what y'all have sown okay If you sown some shit, expect some shit. If you sown good stuff, expect good stuff. Yeah. And shorty girl at the rent office, in the blue van, <laughs> that's running around scared now. Yeah. Keep harassing my kids. Because you're going to be in this case too. Yeah. a lot of y'all motherfuckers that work at the runoff is going to be in this case. Keep playing. God don't like ugly. And y'all doing some ugly shit. So expect to reap the karma. You doing illegal stuff? If you took a dollar of money that was stolen from me, expect to re re reap and receive karma, okay? And for the doppelganger. For the doppelganger. You run around here trying to act like me, trying to be me. Don't start singing on everybody when your ass go to jail. Because you reap this shit and you about to, you done sold some shit, okay? 
stepping into a lane that you don't belong in. And Earl, you should be ashamed of yourself. Because if it wasn't for me, nigga, you wouldn't even made it to 23. You would have been dead like 16. Okay? 13, nigga. But it's cool. Because every last one of y'all, and especially my family members, y'all should be ashamed of y'all motherfucking self. Especially the ones that's receiving motherfucking cash app. Like I don't know. Oh yeah, I know. <laughs> receiving cash app. Hell. Your ass going to jail too. And don't call me to bond your ass out because I'm not coming. I'm not coming. Don't call me. All you're going to do is sit and watch me on the TV. Okay? Since you chose you chose the wrong side. That go for all y'all motherfuckers. Yeah. Especially shorty girl at the post office. You done stole a lot of my mail. You gonna have you gonna have mad charges on you. Mad federal charges. And that's a shame. The company still. Y'all gonna have a bunch of charges on y'all too. For racial discrimination, slander, all types of shit. Oh yeah. And I'm make sure of that. Y'all gonna pay my daughter. You show sure a lie. And your old white man, the one that's been there over 20 some years, I'm gonna make sure. The whole world gonna know about you. How racist your ass is. Yeah, because you was threatened by a young black woman. As smart as a motherfucker coming in showing you how you fucking up on your job and you didn't like that so you felt threatened by her. Start sabotaging her paperwork. Trying to take credit for her work putting your name down on her shit. Oh yeah, all of that. Fast, all you gotta do is go pull the cameras that still and you will see it all. Talk to the lady that hired her. Because they even saw he even got mad at her and sabotaged her because she told my daughter how good she was doing and gave her a company phone and he didn't like that shit. Cause it was a young white dude been there for what, six, eight months before she even got there, and he didn't even know half the shit that she knew. So he didn't like that. That lady had took and gave her her own fucking department. And once she did that, they got mad and demoted her for doing her job. Yeah. And for you little motherfuckers this hat, they come around here stalking around my house and shit. You think that shit ain't seen? Think again. A lot of this shit, I just don't say nothing. But I observe every motherfucking thing, okay? And what I don't see, trust and believe, I get it. I get warnings. So y'all keep it up. Let's keep it up. I mean, hell, the more the merry on my case, the more money the state and the government gonna fucking pay me. Because a lot of y'all is government fucking employees. So keep stacking my bread. Because that's what you're doing. Yeah. And still, we won't have a separate lawsuit for y'all ass. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So keep it up. I 
I just wanted to come and drop this little, little bomb for y'all tonight. So when the court system open up the mod, the, the feds so everybody can see this video. Because you know they monitor my shit. If you don't know, you know now. So shorty at the post office, you need to start singing. Because trust and believe. They will be pulling them videotapes for everywhere that my fucking mail. Yeah post office that my shit's supposed to be coming out of. If you don't know, now you know. So y'all keep paying everybody to help y'all. And y'all stupid because it's like this. They got y'all doing the dirty work and <laughs> they got y'all doing the dirty work and that lets you know that they don't give a fuck about y'all because they know all y'all ass going to jail. So they said they're going to take the whole ship down with them. <laughs> Especially the doctor gang, because she about to snitch on all y'all ass. <laughs> she, he, whatever. <laughs> about to drop the dime on all y'all. And for the Secret Service motherfucker that's monitoring my phone, yeah, you being monitored too. Okay? So why you thinking you so slick? Hacking into my email. Oh, yeah. Y'all even hacked into my daughter's Uber account. Y'all hacked into my daughter's Uber account, and they froze her account because of fraud. So when you couldn't steal her money from her Uber account, that's when you paid the motherfuckers that steal to sabotage her job. And see, the dude with that's been there for 20 years, he was right up his alley because he was jealous anyway. So it was easy to get him. And for the new boss that just started, you just, you just, <laughs> you just got yourself involved in some shit that you ain't even know what the fuck is going on. Being racist. And that's what's going to sink your ass. Okay? Shorty girl, they had the BBL surgery. <laughs> You're having complications because you had surgery with stolen money. Okay? A lot of y'all about to lose y'all lives, though. Because it's not the first time that a lot of y'all done did this shit. It's just I'm the one going to take y'all ass down. Especially the attorney. You love defrauding women. And this woman right here gonna be the one that's gonna sink your ship. Yeah. So keep it up. That's all. Keep it up. You just stacking my dough. That's all. And I appreciate you. I do. I appreciate you. So keep on stacking my dough. Because I keep telling y'all, everything that y'all do is seen. Everything that y'all say is heard. Every thought that you think is motherfucking heard. Okay? A lot of y'all motherfuckers got spurs with y'all ass on the daily. As soon as you call my name, the 